Busloads of protesters converged on Lawyers Mall in Annapolis today. Members of the clergy, students, and citizens rallied for equal justice under the law. Now, they support legislation before the General Assembly designed to hold police and prosecutors accountable. 11 News reporter David Collins joins us live from Annapolis with more on the story. David? Well, Stan, the protesters also marched to legislative officers to take their commands, their demands directly to the people who can actually make them happen. And what do we want? Justice! And when do we want it? Now! A day of action against police violence. When do we want it? Now! The demonstrators carried signs all over the state house grounds. Tyrone West is Baltimore's Ferguson. All black lives matter. And silence is akin to consent. They say they're not anti-police, but rather anti-excessive force, anti-brutality, and demand equal treatment under the law. It has been said around the country, people are concerned that we are protesting against the police. And we're not protesting against the police. We need the police. And so we are here to demand that those... These citizen lobbyists so arrive by the busloads with a list of legislative way. demands. To make sure you got information about why we're here today. They support requiring police to wear body cams, limits on the law enforcement officer's Bill of Rights. They want civilian review boards set up across the state and for lawmakers to establish an independent prosecutor's office to investigate cases of police brutality. It is your duty, your civic duty. Locking arms in front of the House Judiciary Committee, organizers try to put things in perspective. That as legislators and lawmakers are walking in, you are not looking at gods in flesh. You're looking at everyday men and women as well. All power. All power. And so when we engage our lawmakers about specific policy demands, do it in the spirit of courage. We are standing strong and standing Demonstrators strong rally to set the tone for this new legislative session, urging lawmakers to vote in favor of bills that hold police and prosecutors accountable. The next funeral I go to is the funeral where we bury injustice, the funeral where we, in, where we bury all problems, where we bury issues, where we bury all the mistrust. We are here to forge forward. The demonstration was peaceful. Police report no problems. Reporting live from Annapolis, David Collins, WBAL-TV 11 News. David, thank you.